Hey, what's up? I'm Daniel from today's iPhone.com and today I'm going to show you how to set up your iPhone so it will automatically download uh, music and apps and books and stuff like that when you buy them on other devices. So let's say you have more than one iOS device or you have, you know, your computer and you make purchases on it. And let's say you download a song on your iPod Touch. You buy it from iTunes, you download it on your iPod Touch and you want it to download to your iPhone automatically. How do you do that? Well, you have to be connected to the same iTunes account and then uh, it's pretty simple. You're just going to go to your settings then you're going to scroll right down to the store section. So right here where's the store. Alright, now you can turn on automatic downloads and so uh, you can do music, you can do apps, you can do books. I'm just going to do music because uh, I only have a computer, I don't have any other devices, so the only thing I buy on my computer is books. I don't ever buy the apps, or I mean, uh, is music. I don't ever buy the books or the apps on the computer, I always buy them on my phone. So now that I have that turned on, I also have the option to um, use cellular data. Now if I want to do that, I can. So what this means is um, most of us nowadays are on limited data packages. I am not, I'm still... Uh, have unlimited, I say that with air quotes because I'm pretty much limited to 3 gigs a month, but anyway, um, if you want to use cellular data, so if you want to use your um, 3G or 4G, depending on if you have the 4S, you can do that. You can turn this on, but I would suggest probably turning it off and just waiting for you to connect to Wi-Fi. But it's your choice, if you want to be, if you if you never use anything close to your limit, then you would probably are safe to turn that switch on. So, and now, when you buy music from your iTunes account, it will automatically download to your phone. And wazam, it'll work, it'll be great, you'll love it. You can follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash tip underscore Daniel. And I hope you guys have a great day. And, uh, you know, I'll see you guys later. Bye.